It's only three ingredients, they look delicious, and you can see the bacon's held in all our egg, and we have our beautiful cheese layer on top. The entire package is just like a little nest, because you have like the, the bacon that nests in all the egg and the cheese. Today we're making egg nests. So it's egg, cheese, and bacon. Three ingredients and a cookie tin. That's it, let's get started. So our first step is to take our bacon and we're gonna cut it into uh, little rectangular strips like this and we're gonna place it along the bottom. Uh, bacon stretches, so you wanna get the whole entire base of the cupcake filled. And we're gonna just repeat this over and over until we get our entire uh, cupcake tray filled. Up next, you're gonna take a full strip of bacon. Uh, we're gonna fold it in half and we're gonna cut it into two equal pieces, like so. And now we're gonna take our bacon and we're gonna wrap it around the edges. So you might have to stretch it out a little bit Bacon is very stretchy, and we're gonna just put it along the corners. So basically what we've done so far is we've created a cup of bacon. Um, so we have the bacon on the bottom, the bacon on the sides, and we're again, we're gonna repeat this process until we get a full tray that looks like this. Once your nests are all set up and ready to go, you wanna take one egg and my suggestion is to put it in a glass, it just makes it a little bit easier. Uh, but you wanna take one egg and put it in the center of each bacon nest, like so. Then you're gonna take some cheddar cheese and put it on top of each one. Uh, you can obviously, you don't have to use cheddar, you can use mozzarella, you can use whatever cheese you like. Uh, I like cheddar, I think it goes really well together, but that's just my personal preference. Then you're going to put these in the oven for 425 for 30 minutes. Once it comes out of the oven, you want to get a butter knife and just kind of carve around the edges, you want to loosen it. Uh, it might be a good idea to let it cool down like I have. Um, so I've let it cool completely. And then you're going to use a spoon and you're going to pull it out like so. And you can see here we have our bacon with our cheese and our egg. So let's plate it. This is the three ingredient bacon egg nest. Super easy to make. Let's give it a taste. We're going to give our bacon egg nest a try. So it's only three ingredients. They look delicious and you can see the bacon's held in all our egg and we have our beautiful cheese layer on top. So let's uh, let's taste it. So first thoughts, it is basically an egg McMuffin minus the bread. So if you wanna go like carbless or you wanna like cut back your carb, this is such a great way of doing it. And it's extremely easy to make and very healthy. Uh, so the egg tastes very cooked, it's very good. You can see on the inside. And then the combination with egg and bacon, I mean, they go together like salt and pepper, right? And then you have your cheddar, melted cheddar cheese on top. The entire package is just like a little nest because you have like the, the bacon that nests in all the egg and the cheese. So really good recipe. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure to leave a comment down below. Let me know what your thoughts are about this one. Is there any changes you'd make? Would you top it with anything? Um, I know some people like ketchup with their eggs. Would you want to like dip this in ketchup? I guess you could. Uh, make sure to leave a like on the video and do subscribe for more cooking videos. We'll see you next time.